Good morning, everyone. Good evening and good afternoon to viewers from all walks of life. This is Denzomos, and you are welcome to the channel of truth, enlightenment, freedom, and the channel of breaking empire free. If you are new on this channel, I talk about narcissism and narcissistic abuse. I talk about spirituality and I talk about personal and self development. And if any of that resonates with you, I invite you guys to join us. Give us a like, share this video with friends, and you may subscribe if you haven't already. And for those that have always been with us, you are welcome back. And I thank you for your love and support. Let's pull the camera closer. <clears throat> so I've got a notification that my videos have been shared this week, last week, 470 times. That shows that uh, you guys are doing the job as well. You're, you're choosing to share this content with other people, which is a very good thing. So at least we know that we can always reach out to the other people who don't have this kind of information. And we're helping each other, okay? So I do the videos, you share them, people view them and everything. And I really appreciate each and every one of you. For those ones who have always kept on supporting me and, you know, donating to this channel, it helps me a lot as well, you know what I mean, to, you know, handle one or two other things as well. And I do very much appreciate your donations and support. And you are highly appreciated. So today I want to talk about 11 signs that you have shifted into a new timeline. So this is a video, of course, for the chosen ones. You guys are going through some form of a spiritual awakening. This is something that is going to help you. If you have not started, this is something that you, want, you should actually expect. That is usually going to happen along your journey of spiritual evolution and growth. Now, of course, you've had an awakening, of course, you're going through these transformations and uh, so many things is happening around you, so many changes is going on internally, physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually. And you may come to that point where you get a little bit confused because you don't really know where you are on your journey because these things sometimes when you're growing physically and spiritually, sometimes you may not actually see that you're growing. So is the reason as to why I'm giving you this sign so that you can know you can know that actually you have shifted from an older uh, old, older timeline to a new to a new timeline? Because I've told you guys, you constantly will be going through. You have gone through a paradigm shift, and now you're going to start shifting into different timelines. Because remember that you are on this journey to become the greatest version of yourselves. Now, I will also say that this is very heavy sometimes, okay? It is a step that you have to take. Uh, you have to be patient with this process. You have to be, you know, aware that you're not going to be the same person that you used to be. So whichever steps comes your way, embrace that journey because it is a journey for you. Nothing is happening against you. Everything that is happening around you is really happening for you. What is the sign number one that you have shifted into a new timeline this is when you are you are struggling to recognize yourself now the old version of you is gone okay that person you used to be is gone but at the same time you have not yet buffed the new version of you so in the process and now you're struggling to think that there is something wrong with you you're looking around and uh, sometimes you you know you may wake up one day and uh you go to clean your face or to brush your teeth and you recognize that there are some things have started changing, even sometimes in your physical appearance. And you're struggling with yourself because you think there is something wrong with you. Maybe because you think you're sick or something is going on with you. There's nothing going on with you. If you wake up one morning and you look in the mirror and you have a problem and you're struggling to recognize yourself, you have got to know you have shifted into a new timeline. And these changes are supposed to happen. This is part of the process. What is sign number two that you have shifted into a new timeline? That is when everything has stopped. What do I mean everything has stopped? Your phones are not ringing. Your friends are not coming around. You have lost a lot of friends. Um, there is no activity around you, you know. There is no rain. Sometimes it's just like a gray day throughout. Nothing is happening. Everything is completely quiet. There's no noise coming from anywhere. You are spending days and days 
in silence, in solitude. Nothing is happening. That is because you have left an old timeline and you have moved into a new timeline. So you are now starting to transform, like I've said, and uh, you are going to start experiencing, having new experiences in your personal life, uh, spiritually, even sometimes financially, emotionally, and physically. And now the old timeline that you've been on for a while, for a couple of years, it has actually been shut down. Okay, the universe, God, whatever you want to call it, source, has shut down your old timeline. And now you have moved into a new timeline. So you're recognizing that everything around you has come to a standstill. Nothing is happening. Okay, you have applied for jobs. Nobody's calling you. You're trying to go into debt. So everybody's rejecting you. Nothing is happening. Everything has completely stopped. That is one of the very powerful signs that you have shifted into a new timeline, my chosen ones. Number three, sign, third one, that you have shifted into a new timeline is when now you are starting to experience a new wave of challenges, okay? There's a new wave of haters, okay? People are starting to show up hating you out of the blue. They don't even know you. They don't know your name. They don't know what kind of a job you do. They don't know anything about your life. And sometimes you're struggling. It's like you're doing something, but it's like you're pulling one foot after, after the other one, okay? That is because you're actually moving spiritually into a new timeline. And sometimes you're being stuck a little bit between the old and the new, okay? So you're giving birth to a new version of you, like I've said. And there's a new wave of challenges. You cannot sometimes, sometimes it's even very hard for you to um, to catch up with this kind of challenges that are coming your way. And on top of that, you're also experiencing a new wave of different people. Sometimes a lot of haters are coming into your life, okay? You guys have heard the saying, what they say. There's a saying that they used to say, New levels, new devils, okay? So you are in a new timeline. Now you're going to experience a new wave of demons as well and a new wave of haters. If that is happening to you, you have got to understand that it's a natural process and there is something that is being birthed within you to move you towards the highest and greatest version of yourself. The sign number four that you have shifted and moved into a new timeline is when you have actually lost uh feeling for everything okay you no longer want to do anything it's like you're waking up one day and you can hardly get yourself out of bed you know your job is boring you hate the people around you you don't want to you want you don't associate with anyone the people that used to be a part of you back in the days it's like you don't feel like you have anything to do with them you're actually moving towards the greatest version of yourself and sometimes you're feeling like you have lost touch of the old things that used to describe you before you no longer want to go to those restaurants you used to do you used to go before, you no longer have to go on those dates. You no longer want your job. You are now even sometimes hating your job to maximum. Every time you go to the job, you feel like it's a punishment. That is because there is something being created within you that is going to move you out of your old uh, your old timeline into a new one. So you are experiencing this kind of situation whereby you're starting to, uh, to hate. Sometimes you no longer have feelings for anything that you used to do before. It's a sign that you're going and you have actually moved into a new timeline, my chosen ones. The other one, which is the sign number five, that you have moved into a new timeline is when your light is shining much more brighter than it used to do before, okay? People can see this. You go out of your house, you move around, you're doing your daily things. The, th the same thing sometimes even that you used to do before. You're going to, to the shops or whatever, you're going to the malls, you're going to the gym or whatever. People are recognizing that there is some changes about you that they can't actually put a finger to. So people are recognizing this light around you is shining brighter and sometimes it's attracting a lot of attention around you. So when you ever experience that moment when um, you, go, you go out and it's like you can hardly hide, uh, even in the crowds, people will easily spot you, even in the crowds. The, the next person to you, others may not see you, but actually you see, you see that sometimes even the next person to you is going to recognize your presence around them, okay? In one way or the other, even if sometimes they do not even know anything about you. That means that your light is actually shining brighter than it used to. And we're talking about these things on a very spiritual level, okay? So your light is shining brighter and there's many people around you can see this. They're giving you compliments. Oh, what happened? You know, what are you, what are you doing with yourself, with yourself? What kind of food are you eating? What are you doing with your body? What, you know, those kind of stuff. You are, you are getting all these compliments that you actually never used to get back in the days, okay, right, when you're actually vibrating lower. Because remember that now you're starting to vibrate higher. So the sign number six that you have moved into a new timeline is when actually you have clear vision of your purpose. Now, of course, back in the days, when you was in a low vibration, you did not know what you wanted to do. You did not know where to go, what to do, how to move on with life, okay? But at this moment, you're recognizing that you can actually see. You may not have really stepped fully into your purpose, but now you can see that 
Most likely, that's where you want to go, okay? You may not have all the details, but you're most likely starting to smell, even sometimes to touch your purpose. You are stepping into it and you're starting to move towards your life purpose, okay? That is the sign, number six, that you have moved into a new timeline. The sign, number seven, that you have moved into a new timeline is when you are now starting to trigger people around you. Now, as much as the light is shining brighter, remember that some other, some other times you're meeting people, you're encountering people on a daily basis who are most likely vibrating very low. And because of this light that is shining around you, your light is shining brighter. These kind of guys, normally they get triggered around you. You may sometimes see people fighting around you. They may sometimes all of a sudden start to fight between themselves. Even sometimes fight, they want to fight with you for no apparent reason. They start up a fight. You don't know where the fight is coming from. You don't know where the hatred is coming from. You are actually triggering the people around you for some apparent reason. Even sometimes these things are happening subconsciously. And some of them are not even aware of this. Okay? That is a sign that actually you have moved into a new timeline. You are on the journey to become the highest and greatest version of yourself. The sign number eight that you have moved into a new timeline is when you are starting to attract a different group of people. Now, back in the days, you used to have... Uh, a certain category, I could say, type of people that you used to attract back in the days, a certain type of dates you used to go, certain type of friends you wanted to hang around with, but now you're seeing that there is different sets of people coming into your life, out of the blue, out of nowhere, you know what I mean? So normally these people that you're attracting at that moment, those are the people that are usually, uh, most likely, you guys are on a similar timeline. So that's the reason as to why you can now actually recognize each other and see each other. You, you have not been seeing them before. They have been around all this entire time, but you have not been able to get close contact with them. But now, all of a sudden, they are starting to show up in your life. They are coming in and out. You know what I mean? Advice. Maybe sometimes they are coming in to advise you, or sometimes you are advising them, or, or, or vice versa. There is a different wave of people now starting to be uh, starting to get attracted towards your light. Okay, that is one of also one of the biggest signs that you have moved and you have shifted into a new timeline. Now, the sign number nine, which is a very common one. Of course, you may be that guy who is usually on social media, you know, these Instagrams or whatever, TikTok and YouTube and everything. Now, you're, you're recognizing that the algorithms have changed, okay? So now, you're no longer seeing the things appear. Like I've told you guys, we're living in some kind of a simulation. And the only thing that will appear to you will also be mirroring back the energy that you're embodying at that moment. But now, you're moving into a new energy. You're in a new timeline. And the things that are going to start appearing in front of you, whether it is on YouTube, whether it is even sometimes in physical appearance, whether it is online, whether wherever you are, you are going to start now seeing that the algorithms, wherever you are, they have changed. Those algorithm, algorithms are a reflection of the energy that you're vibrating at that moment, okay? Now you're going to start to, you, you will stop usually um, having these things show up, the things that you used to do back in the days, show up on your timelines and whatever, on your... Uh, algorithms and on, on your for you page or whatever you know on your instagrams and whatsapp and everything you are now starting to attract a different set of uh, set of algorithms Th those algorithms are reflecting your energy okay you're a new timeline so that new timeline also comes with a different set of algorithms you will sometimes see the people who are talking about the things that you want the people who are, who are already actually embodying your energy those are the things you are going to see on your screens on your youtube on your phones even sometime around you physically okay it is a very big sign that you're actually moving and you have shifted into a new timeline. Sign number 10 that you have shifted into a new timeline is when you have got unexplainable fatigue and insomnia. You know, you struggle to sleep. Sometimes you can stay up all night. You know, sometimes you can uh, end up going to bed or sometimes sleeping for two, three hours a day or a night. You are struggling. You are completely tired. You are extremely exhausted. That is because you have got a shift in energy. And now you're coming into a new energy. And sometimes your body is trying to cope with this kind of energy. Sometimes it may come as a very big energy. And sometimes it's overwhelming for you. And that's the reason why sometimes your body is trying to cope. And you can actually barely go to sleep. And sometimes you can have very difficult time sleeping. You're always tired. You always want to rest. It's like you can not even get your feet up from the ground. That is a sign that you have shifted into a new uh, timeline. It is a normal process. It is a gradual process. It is a natural process. You cannot fight with this. You can just flow with it and everything will be all right. The sign number 11, which is the last one that you have shifted into a new timeline is when sometimes you may start to experience manifestations here and there. Okay. So back in the days, you used to have a lot of wishes. Oh, I wish I would do this. I wish I would do that. This thing that you have been putting out even sometime unintentionally, 
And now you're starting to see little bits of these things coming up, okay? So you may have started your YouTube channel, for example, a couple of years ago, and you haven't been seeing uh, any results. You know, you have been just like, like I'm, I'm, I'm talking about an example like I've experienced. You haven't, you haven't been seeing results for the last couple of months or even sometime a couple of years. And now all of a sudden, you're seeing that now your channel started to take off, okay? So this may be even sometime a business that you've been doing for quite a while. You have always been wishing that you will get clients, you will get customers, you will get followers, you will get subscribers and things like that. Now, all of a sudden, they are showing up, even sometimes without trying, okay? That is a very big sign that you're actually moving into a new timeline. There are these manifestations that have come in. They're starting to come in. You can smell them. You can even touch them. You can see them. They may not come in a very big, major way, but you will see them. these things starting to come. And you are going to remember that one point back in the days you have wished and you have... Uh, you have wished for something to come into your life. Now you're starting to see a little bit of results here and there. It is a sign. That is because your energy is shifting. And now your energy, because you're now starting to vibrate higher, is that, that means that now that vibration is bringing you into alignment with the things that you have always manifested in your life. So those are the 11 signs that you have shifted into a new timeline. Of course, if there's any sign that you know about that I've not mentioned, you guys can always let us know in the comment section below. You guys know that I do love and appreciate your support. You can book a session with me. You could donate or support my channel if you want to. Everything you need, email, cash up and PayPal. You will find it in the description below. And until then, I'll catch you guys in my next one. There's almost signing out. Much love and blessings. Peace.